to a new video. In this video I'm going to give you a bit of an update uh, on what I have been doing um, the past time and why I haven't uploaded any videos. Um, I've been busy with school and things and everything so yeah I just didn't have the time to upload any videos but I'll get to it eventually but I've yeah there are a few things I want to show you. Um, um, first, for you that don't know it, um, I've got an Instagram page, I'll show you here. The name is triangle DIY, underscore DIY, just um, like my YouTube name, and as you can see I share stuff from school, uh, I study engineering and all the cool stuff that's, um, that's interesting to me, so if you want to follow me, uh, that's my name. So. Um, let's start over here. Um, I have my old hydrogen generator and um, actually last year I built a new one. Um, I haven't tested it yet because I don't have a battery but I will get one soon and then I have to try it out. As you can see those are stainless steel bolts. So this one should uh, put out more um, than the other did. So. Um, also, I got a nice bit of stones. Yeah, there they are. So that that is calcium carbide, and um, they just look like normal stones. But when you um, combine calcium carbide with water, it creates acetyl acetylene, which is um, a very explosive gas so as you may have seen there's a bike here so that's going to be my city bike which is going to be in the city of Utrecht um, but before that I wanted to prevent it some more from rusting and just make it look a little bit cool so it's just all in pieces here so also as you may have noticed um, the styrofoam cutter still not finished um, I started it till now I never finished it so I, I will will finish that um, also I've been organizing maybe yeah it's really messy but I try to organize uh, my shop a little bit more um, to use this, the, the space I have so I've been organizing a little bit um, but yeah when you use it it gets messy so I organize it a bit more so I can work on projects more easy. Um, also trying to set up a more easy way to store my tools. This drawer. So I have to find a place for that. Um, I have some video footage for another two or three videos about aluminium melting but just couldn't get around to edit them so those will be coming soon. Um, also, this is part of a Sterling cool machine um, I built. Um, I have the footage of that, I only have to edit it, so stay tuned, that will come. So, yeah, in the, in the, in the coming year I want to organize this a little bit better and then move on with my projects, so um, I hope to put out uh, a bit more videos then, so um, oh, and there's another cool thing I want to show you. Last summer I picked up this electric furnace. It's originally for clay and such things, but it can reach um, about 1200 degrees uh, Celsius, so I should be able to melt copper with it, so aluminium shouldn't be a problem. Um, yeah, it uses quite a lot of energy but I think it's still more efficient than, than a coal furnace and it's just easier um, yeah I have it since last summer but haven't tested it yet um, but I will get around to that soon so stay tuned for that video so that's it for now um, as you can see I have quite a few pro projects on the go so stay tuned for that um, 
if you don't want to miss them and you haven't please subscribe then and at last um, I want to wish you all uh, a Merry Christmas and if I don't get to make a video before that a Happy New Year see you in 2016